Hello XDC family and welcome back to Crypto Ready. If you want to be ready for crypto then you are in the right place. Today we have got some massive updates for XDC 2.0. We've got a video clip from Atto talking about 2.0, how it's better than Bitcoin. So guys today's video is going to be jam packed. So I hope you will watch to the end. We shall continue right after this intro. Looking at coin market cap, currently the total market cap is 2.39 trillion. Bitcoin at 66.6k, Ethereum at 3.3k. So once again, we have got ranging going on. The fear and greed index is neutral right now. A lot of people are scared that the markets are going to go down. Some people are feeling bearish. Some people are feeling bullish. But I do understand that's how people are going to feel because especially new traders, when they see markets dumping like this, they do get scared and they probably sell at the bottom. But that's not the way to go, guys. Right now, the markets are still low. It's an amazing DCAing an opportunity. Like I always say, utility is going to win the day, guys. So invest responsibly into utility. And right now, XDC and some of the other X coins are ridiculously low. So pay attention. Looking at the latest crypto news, Elon Musk suddenly breaks his silence on Bitcoin after issuing a shock US dollar destruction warning that could trigger a crypto price boom. So finally, we have now got Elon Musk supporting Bitcoin and crypto. And he says, I see some merit in Bitcoin and crypto. And while he says that he has a soft spot for meme based tokens like Dogecoin because he likes dogs and memes. Yes, he's a multi billionaire. Maybe he can mess around with some meme stuff and take the loss without not feeling anything. But can the average person with the average wage really afford to invest in dogs and memes? Obviously not. If you're looking for long term generational wealth, then all I'm going to say here, guys, is utility is going to be the winner. So look into utility, start off with ISO standard coins, ISO compliant projects, and then go from there. Make some connections, follow the right channels. If you're not subscribed to this channel already, please hit that subscribe button right now. And before we look at XDC, I have a second channel called Crypto Utility. The link is at the top of the video right now. Please click the link, subscribe to the channel because I only cover utility on this channel. Tomorrow, I am going to be doing a video on Wadspay WTK, so don't miss out. Looking at the XDC chart, currently it's glued to three cents. Like the rest of the market, a lot of people are leaving comments in my video saying XDC is dead. Right now, guys, the whole market is dead. Everything is ranging at the moment. Nothing is flying high. Bitcoin is leading the market right now. But wait till utility has that bull run because utility will decouple from Bitcoin and we will have that immense, massive, explosive bull run the world has never seen before. And XDC will be leading that, in my opinion. So, guys, pay attention. At three cents, it's an amazing DCAing in opportunity. Looking at Twitter from XDC Foundation. So, guys, we're going to quickly go over. What's happened in the last week with XDC? We had a massive partnership with Deutsche Telekom. They are now going to be running a masternode on the XDC network. We had an interview with Atal, which we're going to be discussing later on in this video. It's a massive one for XDC 2.0. And we had Magic integrating XDC, giving more tools and features to developers who want to make new apps. So guys, it's been an amazing week for XDC. Massive developments every single week. Guys, it's happening in real time. Everything's happening according to a plan. XDC is going to rise above the rest because a lot of things that I see happening right now with XDC, with regulations, I think everything ties in together perfectly. It's an amazing time to be alive and an amazing time to be holding XDC. Looking at tweet from Mr. Man, the co-conveners of the World Trade Organization's joint initiative on electronic commerce announced that the parties agreed on a stabilized text for the agreement on electronic commerce. The XTC network's involvement in the WTO agreement signed on July 26, 2024 underscores its importance in the digital transformation of global trade. So in this letter, guys, they're talking about digitalizing trade via the MLETR framework. And who's involved from the beginning with MLETR adoption? It's the XDC network, it's the XDC blockchain. And we mustn't forget who World Trade Organization are. They have got members worldwide. Most of the countries in the world 
164 states representing over 98% of global trade and global GDP are members of WTO. And if they are talking about implementing and adopting the MLETR framework, the blockchain ecosystem, then you have to pay attention. Because 99% of governments in the world use this organization to establish, revise and enforce the rules that govern international trade in cooperation with the UN system. So guys, you're talking about everybody in the world. This is why I say guys, once one country starts off that domino effect, like the UK's triggered it off, now the rest of the world is following. USA is going to line up. We've got Germany, France, Europe. Everybody's getting ready to be on that level playing field. And don't forget, XTC is at the heart of this transformation. That's why I say, don't worry about the price right now, because they are building the foundations. If the foundations are strong, the price will rise even higher. Looking at we from Rohit, XDC blockchain. And I don't think we need to say anything more on this because as you can see, XDC is the leading blockchain and we are involved in all of the biggest industries in the world. Stable coins, securitization, commodities, trade finance and real estate. And if you combine the value of these markets, guys, we're talking quadrillions of dollars. Is quadrillions of dollars going to be flowing through the XDC network, the XDC blockchain? Yes, eventually it will because we already know BlackRock, JP Morgan, all of these guys, they move trillions of dollars on a daily basis. So having quadrillions move through XDC network, which is the future of finance, is not far fetched. We know it's going to happen. It's only a matter of time. Looking at a tweet from Generation Infinity, real world asset tokenization on XDC. Blockchain adoption shakes the globe. Yes, very clearly, blockchain is shaking the world. We are moving to a new standard, a new future where everything will be digital. From money to trade, everything will be on the damn blockchain. Let's have a quick listen to this two, three minute clip where Atoll is talking about how XDC 2.0 is better than Bitcoin and what's in coming for us. I mean, in, in a way, we are not. So I think that is uh, one of the major improvements and we got uh, like Certic audit and they rated us very highly. Uh, for for the for this overall upgrade and the consensus, which is public and for the world to see. So uh, this is where you know a lot of hedge funds, banks, financial institutions, people who really want to build on something. The moment the more they do their research, they're going to find out. Like look, this is. Uh, I mean, in, in a way, we are not. You know, as I said, not we are not. This is not layer two. It's layer one. So you look at a Nakamoto consensus, and then you look at. Uh, the XC2.0 consensus, which is unique in itself, right? And people will have that analogy that, okay, what can, I already have Bitcoin, what can Bitcoin do that, uh, you know, that XDC can do better? And there will be that unique position for us, always as a layer one to showcase that, that uh, his was a unique creation uh, 12, 13 years ago, and here is a unique creation. Uh, I think that is fundamentally, and especially for the enterprise world, right? Because right now, still, if you're running enterprise, are not really running Bitcoin mining. They're they're buying into ETFs, right? So they're not running running the infrastructure. Uh, it's not also feasible for them to do it. So if you look at Deutsche Telekom or some of the others who are running SDC master nodes, it's not feasible for them run Bitcoin mining. Uh, it, it's, it's a completely different ballgame altogether. And that's when they uh, we've, we've heard from at least four other big telecom firms of the world. After that announcement, they would want to do something similar. So this is very unique. I mean, if you look at Bitcoin, it's success. You have ETF, you have 1.4 trillion asset that's created. And you have XDC, that's fairly unknown. But it's a unique consensus and then you can do so much more. You can have practically top 10,000 companies in the world run their own validators, run their own nodes or run their own staking programs, run their own subnet. I think that is a very, very massive scalability, especially which can, which is brought by the 2.0 upgrade. So we'll see a lot more staking enabled. Uh, that is also, you know, whether it's subnet staking, because the way, uh, the 2.0 is configured, obviously the block finality and 
and overall its architecture it, it will become much more staking friendly so we will have probably multiple fold demand to staking so as you just heard there from the man himself at all xdc 2.0 is way better than bitcoin because when they look at bitcoin and then look at its use cases it doesn't have any use case apart from being a good store of value and in my honest opinion it doesn't even work as a good store of value because it's too expensive and too slow and uses too much damn energy but when they look at xdc what do you think they see they see a fast cheap efficient blockchain xdc 2.0 is due to come out one of the most military grade blockchains in the world one of the most secure what do you think they're going to choose they are obviously going to be choosing xdc because once you look at some of the big connections that we have once you look at all the problems xdc is solving in real time with trade finance with tokenization what are they going to choose guys it's not bitcoin and it's not ethereum the other day guys i had some ethereum i wanted to shift around into a different coin and as I tried to swap Ethereum to a different coin, it was asking for fees which were more than the token itself. So guys, that is definitely not the future. You're not paying for your transaction, which is going to cost you more than what the value of the whole transaction is. That is absolutely ridiculous. That's why XTC is the ultimate winner. XTC won't be the only one here, guys, but it will be the top contender to solve these multi-trillion dollar problems. So all I'm going to say here, guys, is be prepared, be ready, because something massive is incoming for XTC.